While Jesus was in Galilee, he returned to the village of Cana, where he had turned water into wine. There was an official in Capernaum whose son was sick. And when the men heard that Jesus had come from Judea, he went and begged him to keep his son from dying. Jesus told the official, you won't have faith unless you see miracles and wonders. The man replied, Lord, please come before my son dies. Jesus then said, your son will live. Go on home to him. The man believed Jesus and started back home. Some of the official servants met him along the road and told him, your son is better. He asked them when the boy got better and they answered, the fever left him yesterday at one o'clock. The boy's father realized that at one o'clock, the day before, Jesus had told him, your son will live. So the man and everyone in his family put their faith in Jesus. So here's a guy who comes to Jesus with a specific expectation. He wants Jesus to heal his son. He's asking for nothing less than a miracle. And Jesus does it. He speaks life into the body of the kid. The challenge for the official in the story is that he's not in the place where the miracle takes place. So in that moment, he's left with a promise and a long way back home. Your son will live, Jesus said. Sometimes we need a miracle, but all we have is a promise and a long way ahead of us. Jesus then asks us to trust him on the way. So as I read parts of this passage again, check out the order of events. The man replied, Lord, please come before my son dies. Jesus then said, your son will live. Go on home to him. The man believed Jesus and started back home. Some of the official servants met him along the road and told him, your son is better. What do you need from Jesus? I believe Jesus invites us to speak those things out as clearly as we can. Or maybe there's something that you've asked Jesus already, but you're still kind of on the way back home. Why don't you then renew your trust in Jesus? Let's pray together. Jesus, you're the life giver. You speak and things become alive. And Lord, we choose to believe you. We trust you to be the one who cares for us, who knows us, who heals us. Jesus, walk with us.